I'm standing right in front of the Target store on Lake Mary Boulevard where this burglary happened overnight. I am with Kim Canada of the Seminole County Sheriff's Office and she has more details for us. Kim, can you tell us everything you know about what led to this crash? Absolutely. We were notified by Target about uh, 2.23 this morning that they were experiencing an in-progress burglary. They were able to tell us that two vehicles were involved, a maroon and a black, and about six individuals entered the store through a broken glass door. Uh, the six individuals immediately ran to the electronics department, broke a display case there, and then proceeded to take items from within, and then they exited the store the same way they came in and entered the vehicles. Uh, as soon as we were contacted, well, in fact, we were like seconds away, we were able to locate both vehicles as they were exiting the parking lot here. The maroon vehicle sped off. The black vehicle, um, we attempted a traffic stop on it. It did not stop and continued to flee. We did not pursue, however, moments later, we were notified that the black vehicle struck a tree in front of the Aliqua Lake subdivision, uh, burst into flames. The deputy was able to get there very quickly and was able to remove a passenger from the vehicle who had significant uh, injuries. He was transported to a local hospital. Within moments later, we were able to locate the driver of the vehicle hiding in some bushes with the help of our alert helicopter. What's the status of the four suspects that are believed to have gotten away in the maroon vehicle? Yeah, the four in the maroon vehicle are still outstanding, so we're hoping to gather some more information about who they are and see if we can track them down. And what do you know about these suspects? Were you able to get any surveillance video footage from the Target store? Target has been very helpful. So it, because of their video, we were able to connect these incidents together. We were able to identify the individuals in the car based upon the description we were able to get from the Target people and their clothing. All right, an ongoing investigation here at Target and also the crash investigation still goes on in front of the Aliqua Lake subdivision. We will update you as soon as we get more information. Live in Lake Mary, Alex Villarreal, West 2 News. All right.